there's actually quite a bit of stuff. It doesn't look like very much when you first, it looks like a bunch of mud and rocks and water bottles and beer bottles, but there's actually uh, a ton of different clam species. You can see the different colored siphons poking out of the mud. There's um, some big prawns or shrimp down there. I'm not sure which species I have to get a closer look. There's, I saw at least a couple species of crab. There's limpets that are scraping algae off of rocks. So there's a limpet. You can see it just scrapes the bottom of the rocks, scrapes all the algae off the bottom of the rocks. Here's a little decorator crab. So I've got these two nudibranchs here. This one here is a leopard dord, kind of looks like leopard skin. This one here is often called the clown nudibranch and they use their bright colors as a way to warn predators not to eat them. Their name comes from naked gills and that's what these little fluffy bits are here. That's their gills. They use those to breathe but they're uh, pretty cool. They stick out down there. They're very bright, beautiful colors. And we spent a lot of time looking at the stuff on the pilings. There must be 10 to 20, probably more, species of tunicate, which are really, really cool. They're really colorful and super bright, uh, neat little colonial animals. And we saw actually two beautiful leopard Dora nudibranchs baiting, which is pretty cool. There's a couple species of red algae down there and uh, a bunch of snails. There's pretty much every class of invertebrate that you can think of down there. Barnacles feeding, different species of barnacles on the poles. There's, it's like a rainbow of colors down there. It's pretty cool. Well, as it turns out, there's a lot of junk down there too. People have obviously <laughs> dropped their phones, the old school phone, the new school phone. We found this nice saw down there. Certainly no shortage of bottles, shopping carts, plastic knives and forks. It's an unfortunate reality, but uh, yeah, too much garbage in the ocean. It's even right in your backyard.